Hello and welcome to Charlotte Motor Speedway. We are back here today, but this time in B Open. We are going to be running some Xfinity, and hopefully the screen is looking a bit better. I've had to change some things around. Um, apologies for last time. It was at Darlington, I believe, uh, in the Gen 4. Wasn't looking quite right as I got my new widescreen monitor, but got it all uh, figured out, I think. Unfortunately, uh, I won't be able to record and use my full widescreen monitor at the same time, is what I've learned. But that should be alright, because, uh, you know, I'll still be able to take advantage of the monitor whenever I am racing on my own without recording. And the input lag is very important as well um with my old tv well it was a tv and not actual computer monitor which means the refresh rate or whatever i'm not very smart about this stuff but essentially i'm getting a, a more a quicker response for my inputs with uh an actual computer monitor meant for gaming so that should uh, help me out. Pretty happy about that. Just gonna spin a little bit, don't mind me. Holy cow, that got really loose. Got a free setup from OSR. This is a qualifying setup, so theoretically it should be pretty good. We'll see if the driver can do anything, though, considering I spun it. <laughs> on the first lap. So, uh... There's so much the setup can do if I'm spinning the darn thing around, that's for sure. And missing the bottom. Gee whiz. I blew this whole qualifying, I think. But, that's alright. Long race. And, uh... Apparently we... Oh my god. Okay, that's... I was like four tenths up on first. I knew that couldn't last. But uh, we'll still get a decent qualifying here, although I expect to lose some spots. Since I messed up the first couple of laps so bad. I'll try to do a green flag pit stop, so long as the water temp doesn't turn into a water geyser. Oh my god. <laughs> Forgot to hit the brakes for the corner. So... Not a very good representation of what the green flag pit stop will look like, I hope. I shouldn't be pitting from lane 2, but... Got my uh, reference points down. Should be able to get down to pit road if I need to. We've got ourselves a 2.3k strength of field. So, not all that strong. We are the number 4, at least. Now, unfortunately, another side effect of the way I've had to record this now won't be able to see the race lab, uh, you know, widget or whatever on the screen, but I can still see it. And uh, so I can relay that information. So that's really all I wanted to use it for anyway, to get some uh, additional information really easily. Like, for example, the strength of field 2.3, like I said. And uh, I can look around and see like different safety ratings. Like we got some A4.9s around us. So I can tell you the 1 and the 2 got an A4.9. So I've still got the information, just won't be able to see it on screen because I'm doing a game capture instead of a screen capture. And hopefully it looks fine. Um, still might be some things I have to adjust. But I think this is probably the best way to go about it. Let me remember to put in the correct setup before we actually get going. Again, just free OSR. This is often the case. Gonna add some tape. Gonna go to 12 to 1 steering ratio. Gonna lower some brake bias. I think I'll be happy with it right about there. Save that just for the future with my personal adjustments on there. And, uh, oh god, I hope we don't have to start P2, but it's looking like we are. As soon as I take away my <laughs> widescreen. It's alright. Um, like I said, there's still benefits to the widescreen, so I don't regret getting it. 
stinks that I can't actually use it while recording, but still plenty of benefits. And it uh, should still look pretty good for recording, so. Good stuff. Okay, Colton. You ready, ready to get started here there. with our nasty P2 starting spot? I can't complain about qualifying well, especially because I thought I totally just like like completely messed up that first lap and it still ended up being pretty good and you know very close to actually getting the top spot just i don't like starting on the outside of the front row so we'll hop in one left to green it's session one last lap ready go it's going to be difficult i think to uh keep the tires on this thing it really is I give it my best, but I'm already not great at saving tires, and this car in particular, usually pretty difficult to drive correctly. Really wants to get tight, so I'm going to try to uh, be easy, especially into turn three. There's those awful bumps in the middle of three and four, and honestly just kind of all the way through three and four, that'll bounce your car right out of the groove, and make your corner very slow so i'm hoping i can slow it down enough to avoid any problems related to that and uh with about 57 laps on a tank of gas maybe we'll go green and can pit around around halfway have ourselves a good run this is top split that is correct Lots of very fast guys around us, so if they uh, blow the doors off our car, that's okay. You see the, f I, or I guess you don't see the. Sorry, I gotta have to. Get, I'm gonna have to get used to that. So we got like 5.9 in third place there. The number one car with a 6.1k. Very fast. Are they talking on mic and that guy's responding? I don't know. They're, he's calling them idiots, so I'm uh, not really tempted to turn <laughs> voice chat back on. Uh. Right so I'm going to have a lap car. I'm going to try to stay as high as I possibly can. What's happening? What are they talking about? Nothing, guy. Uh... Got the dash up. <laughs> kind of wish I could move that right now. I, I was kind of adjusting it. That's fine. Is it a first gear start? A late tomorrow setup. Me too. We're all just joking around, I guess. Anyone running the Coke 600 race tomorrow? I'm doing the first one tomorrow, hopefully. I'm doing the flying hopefully, I can get a good jump. A concerned. I'm gonna try at least. You already signed up for it because all 40 spots are filled. I think it's going to be a first gear no, start, no, though. Just the one you can register 30 minutes before that one. No, Roger. Never mind. The other one being held tomorrow by a YouTuber in there, so. Come on up on the. Up, up the oh, he's slowing down, so. The data has control. Maintain the green speed until the green flag, then go. I mean, these guys are super green, green, green. Ah, uh, I guess it works. The car inside. Stay high to the car on the low side. Stay high. Still there. Clear. Just kind of get stuck behind the one there, and yellow. Guys. Open races have really felt like fixed races lately. Hey, at least I'm not outside front row anymore. Save some fuel. Good job, 24.
can't hear the 16. Yeah, sorry, you're behind me on that restart. I freaking roasted him. I didn't even notice the uh, two car apparently. Come three wide. Oh, you can make it till you come up. Someone's gonna tell him. I was gonna tell the 16. We can't hear him. I had it missed just barely, and then it's not just me, got right? It. Okay, got everything set on the scanner. Yeah. <laughs> Is everyone just gonna let him Hello. keep talking? Very. Pit road is closed right now. We're under caution. Pit's closed. He's messing on purpose. I don't know. Maybe he's just purposely doing it to shut people up. It's trying to be helpful, but I think he's just purposely doing it to mess with people. Very. That's really cool of them to do. Pace car is out. Not that Pace anyone had anything out. important to say anyway, I'm sure. I certainly didn't. Well, my, my butt was stuck. It was stuck out a little steering wheel edge, sorry. Oh, uh, okay. He wasn't doing it on purpose. Thank you, Barry. Thank you for fixing it. Now, one of the two things while you're waiting on All right. Um, I guess first gear was the way to go. Worked out. Uh, I was careful not to spin him up, which apparently the two did do, and yet he still kind of got on my inside. So how many people got collected in that, roughly? I do wonder if that was a big one. Everybody like 14 back. About oh. 15 cars. Big one, apparently. 14 back. Pretty much. In front of them, but I keep dropping to the back. So about 20 cars. Dang. Yeah, we got a big field here today. 30 plus, I think. So. Man, yeah, we got people leaving. Yeah, I thought I avoided it. One of the many benefits of qualifying well. Came back up. In front of the big messes. Appreciate that, uh, free Q setup. Oh, sorry. Did a great job. And when I feel like I missed the mark, it did pretty well for me, so. Alright, we'll do first gear again. Hey, Tim, you're, um, blinking a little bit. It's not too bad right now. Right? Go go Have a better view this time, too. Oh. Really, my dude? Really? Second gear start is the way to go, I think. That was bad. Car outside, outside, clear. Dang, that sucks. Okay. Well, now I know. Flat five, anyway. <laughs> we don't need to be going that crazy, do we? So, 14 drifted up to 58 out on the entrance, and that's what started it off. Alright, P4, that's fine. Okay. Try to settle in. We are lined up right now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Gotta take care of this thing. All right, that feels good. Slowing it down about that much really uh, helps mitigate that feel of the, the bumps on the car. 
I guess you didn't hear me when I said 29 take bottom. Everyone seems to be content riding right now, at least up in the front. It's good. Got a lap car staying low for some reason. What is this guy doing? Oh my god. Uh, oh, is this single split? Maybe that's what happened here. Imagine he's probably going to get the lucky dog unless he was already multiple laps down. Save some more fuel, I guess. Pit road is now open. Four course yellow. Pits are open. Check Dang, I feel like the races I've been in lately have just been huge wreck fests. It's making it kind of boring off the start of these races. They usually pick up and get interesting, but I apologize. Seems like every race I enter, it's just yellow flags to start the first 20 laps. Got nothing I can do about that, but still. <laughs> People stick around. Car 16, got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. So it actually wasn't the 16 with the lucky dog. He must be multiple laps down. I wish he wouldn't have a... Or no, did that say 16? Maybe it did. I thought, for some reason, I thought that said 19. I'm losing my mind, I guess. So second gear start, I've learned this time. Or maybe I'm just really bad at restarts all of a sudden. That could happen too. We'll find out. Turns out it's a third gear restart. Who, who could have guessed? God, no. That would be terrible. I appreciate the guys around me, though. They've been very patient so far. Kind of just focused on keeping it single file. Got some smart guys around me that I, I feel like. Pretty much everyone around me is A4.9. It's not too hard to, to get that. I race things very easy to get safety rating, but everyone's, you know, doing a great job so far. First through fifth right now, all A4.9. So, since we've done almost no laps on these tires, we're just going to take our planned halfway green flag pit. Just add on the number of laps we've done so far, essentially, and then... We're under caution. Pits are closed. I guess we'll pit, like, lap 56. Something like that. Maybe 55. Undercut it a little bit. Guess that's the new plan. Really haven't done anything at all yet. Except for get a bad restart. <laughs> Like I said, hopefully things are looking okay with my, you know, adjusted resolution and everything. I had to take it back to a 16-9 aspect ratio. So that way it looks good on YouTube without big black bars on the top and bottom. As it was in the last video. And um, if you happen to know a better way to do it, uh, <laughs> I'd be really appreciated. But I don't think there is one. I think it's just, you know, you're trying to fit the square peg in the round hole. And you're, you know, trying to record widescreen and then put it into non-widescreen, you know, the 16-9 ratio, and it's closed. it just doesn't fit. It doesn't make sense. The only way that would work is if you stretched the video out, and that looks very bad, so I'm not going to do that. Instead, I've uh, what I've done is made my iRacing window 16-9 resolution, and then uh, told OBS, which I use for recording, to record the game itself rather than my actual screen that I'm seeing right now. And since the game is a 16-9 resolution, it looked pretty good. I hope. Should look like it used to.
So we'll do second gear this time. Hopefully get a good view of the leader. You may have noticed the restart zones are on, so we can't go until we get uh, next to the Geico restart zone painted on the wall. For those aren't familiar with how that works. Got the extra bit of tape on this thing. We haven't had a very long run yet, but I got 66 when the default was 64 for this setup. Don't think it'll be an issue, but we'll keep an eye on the temperatures. I'm glad I have the dash there. Okay, ten point on the car. See that easily. No, put it in there, so I'll just play the field. Hope I'm doing this right. See if this is better or worse for a restart. Pace car is off. Time to do your job. It still wasn't very good, but I guess it it's a works. Back position. Let's see if we can get it. Probably not. Yeah, make sure you're reporting for that one. Yeah, he'll get it. It's fine. Just taking a look, seeing if I can get it done. Not quite. Don't want to fight too much. So we'll file back in line. Able to hold off the five behind us at least. The three does move forward though. And uh, whoever that is wants to go around the outside apparently. Why are we three wide? I did not want to be three wide. Alright. He's going hard, so... That's fine, I'll let him go. Wow. Wow. Fine. Oh, I got you can drive up into me if he wants. I'm moving. We were being patient, I thought, and then we ended up three wide. So I guess I shouldn't have said anything. I jinxed it. Temperature's pretty high. Clear him. Six is already pushing. Gonna get to his inside. Ugh. Feel good. I just felt like I got a kind of bounced up into him almost. Uh, well, I was going to say, he wasn't very good at a four last lap, but then he, uh, just fine right there, so who knows. 
He's gonna push it. Get around me. That's fine. I'm pushing harder than I want to right now. I just I keep ending up side by side with guys without really wanting to. Wanted to maybe get around a guy earlier and then it was three wide and I definitely didn't want that. Especially through this like quad oval. Alright, this guy's getting loose. I'd like to get by him. He's really struggling in three and four at times. Hope he doesn't dive it in on me. He's definitely overdriving three and four, and I think it's already hurting him. I was worried he was going to run in the back of me, maybe. But uh, he was ready for me to be slower than he's been entering, so that's good. Wow, I really missed the bottom there. That was bad. Seems like everybody kind of went the same speed through the corner that time, though. Stingley. This thing's already getting tough to uh, Justin, put it where I want to. I'm going to try to be high if you catch me in the corner, or I'm going to try to get uh, to as low of the racing surface as I can if we're on straight. Really trying to keep it down by that blue line. Your most rotation down there, I think. Oh my god, what are we doing? I'm pressing the wall up there. Scary. Let's uh, see if we can get around this without dying. Alright. So far so good. Be low because of that guy. Be out. Feeling okay. Still, there are guys around me that I think are just better than me. Like the guy uh, directly behind me, I think, they passed me before too long. Without much trouble. Feels so much better when you can get it down to that blue line. It hooks up so much better than if you are laying up. So then it just feels like it's pushing the whole way around. Breeze driving away. We're kind of catching the one though. Hind kind of gets on my rear end and gets me a little bit loose. Okay, side by side behind the five seems like he's moving forward. Still 
outside clear. If I will go around, that's okay. Still just not quite ready to throw it all on the line and start uh, driving harder. Soon, that's what the five's doing. Or not, maybe he saved his tires and that's just his car's speed right now. Hard to tell. It does look like he's pushing it a bit. Can't tell if the two wants to get around me or not. So I feel like he's uh, right on my rear end on entry sometimes. And I don't want to be like slamming on the brakes in front of him. I feel like that would be annoying. But I'm just trying to uh, stay disciplined. Slow down for the corner, you know? right there. I don't really want to pass it though. Not yet. I'm sliding up a bit. I'm just kind of getting loose late corner. guy behind me not to run me over. Really had to slow it down so I didn't drift up into the two. I'm, I'm actually pretty surprised how loose this is getting. I was really expecting to get tighter and tighter. I have to try a different line. Keep high. Bottom. Bottom. Really loud on my left side. That's uh, not as close as it sounds like he is. drifting up mid-corner, it feels like. Man, I'm getting loose down there. This car is handling very strangely. It's super tight, and then it kind of starts breaking loose mid to late corner. It's kind of weird me out. Really sure how to interpret it. He's six right now, though. It's not so bad. Tires feel okay. I'm just... Trying to figure out what it wants from me. But I feel like I'm not like falling off terribly or anything. It's just kind of tough to drive. Which is fun. So I'm not complaining. Sometimes I wish I were a better driver. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. They're doing something. Car getting real interesting here. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear outside if you want to. Why do you keep walking and turning to your left? So we got the uh, 12 right behind us, but then we got a ne ne uh, nice gap, sorry, can't speak, to the next guy on our lap. So that's interesting. It's 
Seems like it really re rewards being patient in 3 and 4 on the throttle. It's getting on it to it early really does push you up the track. Why the lap cars are going low? Car clear. Wow, he's really off pace. And a brake right there. Keep low. Clear outside if you want it. Outside. Keep low. When uh, because of that weird situation, I opened the door a bit. I don't know if we're actually going to be able to get around him, though. Clear outside if you want it. So, uh... What did I say? Like, 55 is the plan? Oh my god, where's the turn? That just stopped turning. That was awful. I get it though, because that's what just happened, and I think the 12 sent it on him. It's bad for my bad. I just got the horrible Titan 1 and 2 that same lap, so I understand. Good, we've survived. Hold on to this darn thing. That was a 32.8. Car outside. Clear high. He's I, I feel like uh, my car has speed in it. I feel like I'm just having trouble actually driving the thing. To be honest with you. I don't know, I'm just not avoiding those bumps very well. There we go, hit the mark there. See, if I can do that, it's fine. Really just gotta get it just right. It hooks the bottom. better in three and four that time too. I might have to just take a slightly different approach to make it around those two turns. I guess 55 was about where I wanted to pit, something like that. Got a little bit of space behind at least, but only a second, so that's not too crazy. Ooh, we're getting really loose now. Crazy how tight it is on entry and then how loose it gets later in the corner. It's really moody, the car is. I think that guy behind is actually catching up. Okay, Colton, that's half distance. Estimate 16 laps remaining on this tank. You've just done a 32.7. Okay, I'm going to really have to fight it now. Uh-oh, he's, he's nearly spinning up there. I got it. 
Yikes. So it's not just me, I at least, I guess. I didn't know that time I realized I needed to slow down. It was too late. How much if I ride in this middle line? Am I going to regret this? Uh, pretty equal, I think. By the time we get to the end of the straight there. I've uh, got a battle up there potentially brewing for the lead, I think that is. You see that out in the distance. Got that bottom line there. That's fine. Come on, God, the bumps in this corner, man. Or a pie. Now drive. Clear. Almost get it under him, but not quite. You're welcome. Um, kind of missing the bottom there. We're fine, we're fine. Bring it back. Don't, don't spin out on exit. This is a challenge, but this is pretty fun. I'm really liking how the uh, tire is affecting the handling of the car. It's not good. It's not good. It doesn't feel like I'm driving a very stable car, but kind of the fun of it sometimes, right? Driving a car that's kind of wild and crazy. It might mean I don't have the talent to keep up with some of the guys up front, but that's uh, how it's You're supposed to be, right? That's this guy's uh, belong at the front. You literally came that's not me, that's fine. Yeah, I figured with Tyler. I'm gonna make a pass on the 12. Right there. He gets the nose. Slow each other down. Oh my gosh, I've got a tire warning. So we really are hurting in these uh, these rubbers. Back up early. And caution. And it's really looking forward to green flag pit stops. Pace car is out. Line up single file behind car number 12. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. That was good racing there. It was uh, fun to try to hold on to this thing. Oh, let the 27 by? Yeah, the position when the yellow flag came out. Oh, yeah, bro. There he goes. Kind of nervous. Got people coming up behind me. I watched Gavin's race here at Charlotte. In the uh, what was he in though? He was in the next gen for that yeah, one. Good racing there. Was fun. <laughs> and he got yeah. destroyed oh, from God, behind under caution twice in the same it's race. I'm not worried that's gonna happen to me. It's happening. Appreciate it, Wingo. I got it too. 
Did we, did we all just get black flag? I'm going out here. Why the fuck are we stopping on the track? Three, two, one. Right here. Not past the safe star. So let the two star five, which I did. 44 48. Didn't want you to get a black, man. Too late. You gave it to about two or three of us. We had a couple people got the black flag there. Thank you, 31, for wrecking me on the back stretch. I don't know what to tell you. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. That's your fault for not knowing how to catch the field and get in position. Oh, well, that's interesting. Uh, we're going to be passing some people, apparently, because of black flag. Who all, uh, who all got a black? I got one. Justin got one. Or, Tyler got one, sorry. That sucks. Yeah, I got one too. At least we avoided, uh, that fate. I didn't want you to blow So we have enough fuel to make it at the end. No idea we're gonna be restarting oh, since... Get the in the back somewhere. It's like going to prison, Doc. You just don't talk yourself. You'll be okay. We, we've got people that need to figure out where they're going. Lining up. I just know i got to stay behind the 7 right now. I think we're getting it figured out, though. I think they should have an admin on these races. That way they can just, like, obviously, if somebody did something stupid and we all got black flag for something dumb. What do we have, like, a stop and go, or is it past the race? Forty seconds. So bad. Can, uh, sometimes. Some of these penalties, I feel like the punishment doesn't fit the crime either. <laughs> Forty seconds. I mean, that's ridiculous. That's race ruining. A well, penalty under yellow should just be kill in. I don't. I don't get that. Twenty-seven. There was like seven people in beer. Especially not like when we're just entering Pit Road and somebody stops on the track. I don't... Ridiculous. Yeah, I always felt like under yellow, it was just back to the pack. <sighs> well, that sucks. Uh, you don't really want to gain spots you don't earn from an officiating error like that. Especially being one that's automatic. We'll take it though and we'll run with it. We'll see what we can get now, but. Kinda stinks. We want to be able to compete against well, everybody on equal. First lap, just so we to wear. Equal playing field. So, starting P6, it looks like. 22, you need to go by me. I'm telling you to go by you now, I'm telling you to go by me. I guess we'll do second gear start again. Hey, tell I was that blinking that lap? Can't, uh... No, you're good, man. So I think the two has to pit. We got a couple of guys that need to pit ahead of us, though. So that's... We're gonna have to make sure we let them get down to the bottom. And it's time for them to enter hey, pit road. They could still end up back in it if uh, another caution comes out and things work out for them. Hey Joseph, uh, just so you are aware, I do have to do a pass the penalty or a hold, one of those two. So I'm coming on that one. Okay, I'll try to give you a run, but I've answered it before, so I don't think it's not stop, but we'll see what happens. Oh, I'm just saying don't run in the back of me, I'm trying to get the bit, is all I'm saying. Alright, you sir. You're not the only one, right? That's when it's like four of you. About to go green, stay focused. I hope I get in there when the yellow comes out. So we'll see who's even left once this first lap goes by. Green, 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 green. Much better start that time. Yeah. 
dog. I'm bed here. Two carpet. Keep high. Clear inside. Car inside. Clear. Car inside. I feel like they made it pretty clear they were going to need to pit. Really? Come on. Come on. Oh, he did not call that he was pitting, did he? I did not know the file was pitting right there. We're under caution. Pits are closed. He said he was. God, come on, really? They, they said they had to pit. And we just send it in the fucking cars, waiting for them to try to get over the pit? I thought the guy that was pitting was behind me. I passed him on the restart. I, I passed the pit. The guy was in the uh, start finish line. Just dumb. There was like four of them that had to serve that penalty. Yeah, there was a lot of lap cars. Hopefully your damage isn't too bad. Getting lead lap, lead lap cars in trouble. Oh, that's, that's pretty open statement. I held my line, I held up high. So. I was on the outside lane. Made sure I was up there. Someone else didn't do their job. I mean, maybe I misjudged or something. Like, I thought I had passed the guys who were going to um, be pitting. And then those got my outside and they got in front of me. I didn't really have any work anyway. You probably did, but the record got to start finish. I'm not down on power, am I? No, no, I hit him and I hit a guy in the three and four. Hey, Brandon, I was trying to leave a space for you there going into three. I, I, I can't wait much longer. 2,000, we're good there. I think our damage would be on the left and right side. I don't think we hit it too bad. Got hit it too bad anywhere. Yeah, and I'm sorry about that. I didn't. Well, Nine uh, at least we didn't get the worst of it, I guess. Uh, I got that on lap two. I don't think those guys were able to take their stop. Tyler, did you not take your penalty? Yeah, I did. Hey, let me Did you Yeah, mine was 26 seconds. How was yours? Just one. One second. Yeah, I was just in a bad spot there, because I thought I tried to tell us to try to get out of there. Hey, man, do I have a game to this? How was yours one and mine was 26? It's just not familiar. Full course yellow, pits are open. Yeah, 26 seconds up. Turned off, like, For the penalty? The I feel like that's new. I feel like it used to be 40. Could be wrong. I don't know why that would matter, but it does. Well, I just learned something new. That's right, I forgot about that. You can turn off your windshield tear off and stuff. Hey, man, you got a copy? Closed. Pit road is closed. Pace car is out. Pit road is closed. Pit road is closed. Pit road is closed. Now you're good. Do I have any other things? Just turn a little map, too. Well, we're P4, so things are going pretty well. I, I hope really this damage doesn't affect us too much, but we're definitely not the only one with damage. So. I just got super lucky. And like I said, I, I think it was it the 5 that I rear ended in the 3 and 4. I closed my eyes. I <laughs> closed my eyes. Yeah, it was me. Sorry, man, I thought I had passed. Everybody had moved past. That was just a lot of judge on my part. And like I said, there was someone on my outside. And I got a little flustered there, so not bad if I messed your car up. Hey, too bad, you're good. But uh, that is why, because you're starting behind me, that's why I, I said it. No, no, I know. I, At the end of the like day, said, it's a, a crappy situation I caused by flaws outside. from automatic officiating. It's really just a really sucky situation everyone just gets put into. Everybody's got all these painted numbers and stuff. It's hard to keep track of who to without looking at the relatives of the entire time. That said, if you know people are going to be pitting, probably best to just take the outside. 
In three and four. Yo, H E I V E. Let's go. But one to green. We are going to start P4. I know Timothy wants to switch talking. We went okay, I think. And we'll yeah, see how the damage affects us. No engine one, damage, at least. That's what we're going to have to do. I don't think we have any nose damage, which is probably the worst thing that could have happened. I think we avoided uh, any of that. Just maybe some left and right side stuff. Which I can't even really see, so it can't be too oh, major. Man, I'm just going to cruise. I ain't going to put anybody in a situation. situation. So we'll see what happens here. Today I've just been getting fucked, so it is what it is. Yeah, I had a rough night last night, and this one's shaped up to be similar. Uh, I don't think we have anyone else that still needs to pit, thankfully. I think I, think I cracked the code for restarts. I think it definitely is a second gear start, and you just have to have a good reaction time, which... I got a fall last night started because I got no, Apparently I don't always have, so... Going into the pit last night. No, I was there. I know. Then he took out the leaders. How did take him out? Get ready. No, he did run it into you. The car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green. 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 That's about as close as it gets. We're good, though. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Still there at the bottom. Still there. Inside. Clear. All right. Get around him. It's a track position. That would be nicer for the tires. Yeah, that was about a car length exactly I was given on the outside there. Back it down real good in three and four. Make sure we're getting enough turn without getting too much on the right front. Still a decent amount of laps left, so I can't get too crazy. I like that I have a little bit of room behind me so I can brake how I want to. I feel like I, normally I can't go into turn three as soft as I want when I got people right behind me. I'm not going to be able to this lap, I don't think. Car outside. Outside, clear. Inside. I think that I'm not going to fight the guys. You guys think I'm sure you guys play. Still there. Huh. Still inside. I'm gonna take care of the tires, but these guys are really flying. Don't want to lose 10,000 spots either. Dang it. Just getting freight trained. I'm that bump. Yeah, Brandon. Yeah, Brandon. Clear inside. 
All right, finally get back in line. Really trying not to kill my tires, man. These guys are going a little bit faster than I want to right now. Too many laps left to be really just sprinting. What's that water temp I'm looking at? <laughs> Should be okay, but you know, keeping an eye on it. Yeah, it should be fine. It already looks like it's uh, calming down a little bit. Inside. Still there. Hold your line. Clear inside. And back off early. Just get a run out of the corner. At the six by. Don't want to race side by side. I almost feel like I have a little bit of damage slowing me down too. It feels like they're pulling away on the straightaway just a bit. Seventh position. Not to make excuses, but it does feel like we exit the corner about the same speed. Like here, I got a little bit of a run on the 12, maybe. Eh, no, it seems fine. Probably all in my head. If anything, he's got damage. It's pretty slow. He just went through that corner. Yeah, he's down on top speed for sure. Inside. Still there at the bottom. Go around the outside. Clear Not the best inside. way to do it tire-wise, but I felt like that was the way I was going to get away with it most easily. Hopefully it's green to the end. I, uh, I'm happy with where I'm at right now. P6 isn't bad at all. P6. The lap time was at 1.7. What's the 10 got for us? Let's see. Thanks, Mary. We're both tore up. Yep. I'm going to in 3 and 4 up. once I've kind of figured out how I need to drive it. Man, they're getting away from me, though. Flight guard, the airline. In front is now. Going out of pits. Right. Under of that. I think the six just got the wall. Hmm. We'll see how tires shape up as this thing goes on. Now they're still pulling away. What is going on up there? I see someone on the apron going all the way up to the wall. Assuming that's a lab car having trouble. That's a little scary. Okay, been onto the pits or something? What was that? Please don't bring out a caution. The lap time was at the one point eight. Some lap traffic coming up. Those are guys I think that might have uh, gotten penalties. Really wanting to send it in on me, it looks like. I think he's gonna get it here. Inside. Still there, inside. Still there, inside. Still there at the bottom. Not that time was 32.2. Seven's gonna go ahead and go by, that's fine. Picked a good time to do it. Clear inside.
I need him not to be slow, though. Nah, he's good. He drifted up there. Maybe hit some bumps bad, but he's good. Seven right now. Missed it. It's the bottom. I mean, didn't slow down quite enough. That was making me nervous. All right, he's gonna dive in on me, I guess. This is more important than yours, man. At this point. Context matters. I'm to the end of this thing. I didn't even cut him off. Like, he just... <laughs> expected me to give him a ton of room, I guess. Like, no, man. I'm trying to get sixth here. Alright, so we're going to be coming to 8 to go. Do we have anything for the 10? Question. Definitely don't if I'm going to keep hitting the bumps wrong in 3 and 4, though. That was awful. I think we should at least be able to hold on to a top 7, though, because... Got a little bit of a ways back. The 15 back there. Side, or just overdrove it for where he's going. He really, really wants to get by me for a spot that doesn't matter. What are you doing? I just gotta let him by because he's gonna wreck me if I don't. You're faster past me, and I'll see what the problem is here. If not, leave me alone. Jesus. There's been so much time to this guy. I tried to let him go, I went so slow into the corner. He still couldn't pass me. I lose freaking seventh because of this guy. I'm gonna be pissed. Alright, now you better be fast. You're gonna battle me for it. Come on now. Well, you're irritated. I mean, he, I don't know why he really wanted this spot. Really going up in there, passing people, huh? To be fair, I wasn't gonna pass anyone either up there, but I got someone pursuing me pretty fast. Outside. Still there, hold your line. Clear outside. Car outside. 
You've got two laps to go. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Fifteen is friend or something? Keep low. Two laps Still running. there. Clear outside if you want to. He better face he better battle the fifteen like he battled me, man. Flag. One more left to go. Oh well, we got one lap to go. All should be well. White flag, last lap. Your last lap time was at 32.5. Yeah, so seven should be what we get here. I think the 15 is bat or the five is battling the 15. Reasons unknown to science. Good win. Whew. All right. P7. That's good. According to Race Labs, it'll net us an uh, estimated that's 7 I rating. Chicken flag. Chicken flag. Good race. Good win. Nice run. Solid work. It's not a place to park. The three ends up with the win. Alright, so hopefully that damage didn't affect us too bad, or at least it didn't seem to. I mean, that's what I mean to say. It doesn't seem like it affected us too bad. 74, 78 for that last run. It's not too bad, especially with the left rear wearing a little bit more. Pretty close to even, not so bad. Who knows how much uh, the damage was affecting us, but 4x kind of sucks. Long enough race, though, I don't think it's going to lose us anything, if anything, slight gain potentially I guess for safety rating break even probably but uh, we'll take a look and see what happened we'll see uh, that pit in destruction in addition to some other stuff 14 kind of enters high taps the 8 sends him around and Yep, that really was about 14 on back. Holy cow, that was a lot of people. Yeah, that was a pretty big one. Yeah, that 14 just doesn't really turn down, I think. Like he needs to. He's entering like he's going to take a middle line or something. And uh, 8 turns in. As normal. And then there's just everybody's... We're just starting the race, so everybody's right next to each other. So then everyone's just going to get caught up in it. Ooh, hey, nice job to the 31. He avoided it. That was pretty smooth. Slowed it down very well. And got around it. Did exactly what he needed to do. Get off the racing surface and found a way around. Got people behind him that didn't make it through. Just a, a big old mess. That's what you have to chalk that one up to. A big old mess. Oh. Theory damage. 18 kind of drives in real hard to it. Big damage to a lot of cars. Sixteen just going to let, let the wheel go, I guess, and come hit the 30 one more time. I don't know. Some people just let go of the wheel when they wreck. Don't know why we're seeing that, but lap four, it looks like we're about to come to the restart. 31. Oh, that's weird. Brake checking somebody? Probably not intentionally, but he avoids all damage in that wreck, and then he gives himself damage under the yellow. I mean, look how far off he is, too. What's he trying to jump the start? weird. Lap 6, the 9. Oh, blew a motor. I think that's what that was. Tied to gas. The way he just completely lost all speed right in front of the uh, 23. Can't really anticipate that. Just 
twenty not able to slow it down quite enough. Uh oh. Thirty one's got more trouble. He's just getting loose, I think. Yeah. Self corrects it. Oh, uh, he had that thing saved too. I think he had that saved, like right about here. He just needed to not let it go to the left. I think maybe he saw this 26 flying in, though. Maybe he had to avoid that. Not sure why the 26 is aiming for him. <laughs> it's like he's trying to make it as close as possible. Kind of weird. Thir Ow, that was a big hit for the 13. Under yellow. Guess he forgot the quad oval was coming. I don't know why he turns right, right there. It really is like he forgot the quad oval was coming, just because the yellow came out. That's kind of strange. What we got going on here? Looks like the... A bunch of nothing. Some damaged cars. 29's gonna find the wall. Not much grip up there. Got some more of it. I guess we'll move along since we know these are just wall hits. Don't really need to see all of them. We'll keep going until we see some cars near each other. Man, they are struggling. These uh, Xfinity cars are a uh, hard mode, on, are like straightaway hard mode. Even the straightaways are tough. That's how wobbly they get. Ready three is gonna get tight. Comes up into the path of the nine. Doesn't lift for him. Moving right along, we're still only in the t or just now getting to the lap thirty area. Pretty crazy, so many wall hits. Looks like we're gonna get more there. Let's keep it moving. Man, I don't know if like guys are on like the default set and it's like super tight or something, but they are really having a tough time getting the thing slowed down enough for the corner. Finally, over halfway through. It's like it seems like a handful of the same guys a lot of the time as well. Finding the wall. Here's me. Probably just uh, getting a tire warning. I remember I got a tire warning right around that time. Some blinking happening. Leader. Keeping it moving. Wonder what caution, what caused the caution coming out here in a lap or two that unfortunately prevented us from getting a uh, green flag pit stop. Ooh, here it must have been at 31. Man, I praised him early on, avoiding that caution. He's just had trouble the rest of the race. Again, turn two's going to get him, but this time it's because he's tight, and then he just can't hold on to it after that, I think. Just fishtailing it down the back, and the 27 finds him. And uh, there's where we lost our green flag pit stop. We'll get this thing back going again. Watching uh, <laughs> some blinking. Ooh, I got that pretty good, didn't I? So this is that incident. Man, he was blinking, too. Getting into the pits. Yeah, 12, like, come on, man. <laughs> I mean, I know he said that uh, he didn't know the 5 had to come in, but I guess it's just me. Like, when people, you get a group of people saying they need to come take a penalty just for one lap, just take the outside. And then it, did, it didn't help that that guy was blinking, too. And then net code. Put me up in the wall. So it really was only a tiny little tap on the left. And then, uh, Pancake the wall.
What did it look like behind us after everybody had to avoid all that? Lots of people going into the grass to avoid it. You can kind of do that a little bit more here at Charlotte with the uh, artificial turf. Easier to drive on if necessary, but you can see butterfly effect. Oh my god, what a what a wreck. No one's ever going to slow down for anything, so... <laughs> they uh, find some slow cars to run into. It looks like... Uh, 32. How was the uh, 26 that slow? Just slowing down for it, assuming there was going to be a caution, maybe. And this is probably part of why you get so many people flat footing it, because when you do slow down, you get run over. Big mess right there. Tons of people just flat footing it right through there. You get a big wreck. McDonald's got uh, driven through. Ah, how about that? So, again, under caution. Back to green. Lap 64. Wall hits, it looks like. Just a blink right there. Moving right along. Is this one it was really close with the 10? No, that wasn't. I think that might have been earlier. Just curious if that was. I was just going to take a look, see how close it was. Not a big deal, though. Blinking for the lead. And uh, just about to the end of this thing. Lap 83. Probably just going to skip through a couple more wall hits, I imagine. Because I think it was pretty clean from there. 13, almost losing it. Oh my goodness, we almost had ourselves a green-white checkered, I think. Thankfully holds on to it. No one around him to run into him. And uh, just finishes finishing this thing up. It looks like these guys are finding their finishing positions, and we found ourselves in P7, so... I, I feel like I did about as well as I could hope. I... You know, hard to say if the damage affected me at all. It really wasn't too bad. Just a wall hit. A pretty solid one, but I don't think it affected me too much. Um, yeah, I just... Uh, about where I needed to be, I think. I think I was about skill level around there, so... I'll take it for sure. Uh, P7. And uh, a pretty fun race overall. Had a, bit, a, bit, a couple of little issues, but not too bad. And uh, it was a pretty good one, so... Thank you for watching. Hopefully the video looks a little bit better. I hope it recorded properly. And uh, if not, I will continue to work on it. But for now, I will see you next time. And I hope you have a good one. See ya.